Hey people, Zarthwomp here, and welcome to episode 16 of Earthbound. Last time, we accessed the waterfall that was near Saturn Village, and we and we found Master Belch's factory. We defeated the enemies inside, defeated Master Belch, and learned that the Manny Manny statue is in Foreside. So, we're probably going to be going there soon, but we also saved the Mr. Saturns from the factory, so that's good. So anyways... Let's go and check out the cave that we saw earlier, when we were near the hot springs. Okay. Let's... yeah, it's right up here. I don't know what the pers pers eh, purpose of that side cave is. But, let's go. Okay. What's in here? Okay, cactus guys! Right, Ranbob! Okay, Ranboob! Okay, 6, 75. Ugh, that hurts. Paula, you can use a fire. Jeff, shoot. How much health do they have? Okay, we came tame. We came tame. Okay, 1600. Okay, how much you want to bet that this leads to the next area? Leads to the next, your sanctuary location. Okay, hopefully there's a butterfly in this area. Okay, Ness, you can bash it. Paula, we'll use a fire beta. Jeff, spy. Four, one ninety-seven. PSI fire. Okay, judging for that description, we have a light. We have a shield. Okay, became tame. Okay, that was a lot easier than the first round. Okay! This is leading us nowhere. Okay. Top mobile screw. Okay, maybe this leads us to the desert. Paula, let's use let's try a freeze. I think that thing is gonna be weak to ice. Okay. Stop moving. Okay, that hurts. Oh, thankfully with three people, things are a lot more manageable. Okay, let's do this. PSI ass. Paula. PSI fire. Jeff. Hit the rain boob. Okay, 80, 92, 72. Okay, 47, 63. Okay, that hurts. Come on, Jeff, Jeff. No, not Paula. Okay. Shoot. On the mobile sprout. Okay, and Jeff has been poisoned. Stop moving, and... Stop moving. Okay, level 30. Offense went by 1. Luck went by 1. Max HP went by 3. Okay. Let's just check. Okay. Poisonings, nausea. Okay, PSI... Jeff. Okay, we'll also use a life upon Jeff. Okay, and while we're here, might as well, and since there's a butterfly there, we might as well just also heal Paula.
Okay, don't make this hard on us, butterfly. Okay. Hopefully it's just this one. Okay, it's just two of them. Okay, attacks. Okay, we took one down. Okay, again. Boom. Twelve hundred experience. Okay, strutty evil mushroom. Okay. S will bash on the rain bob. Paula, you can use another PSI freeze on this guy. Jeff, you can shoot it. Actually, no. Slime generator. Okay, nice. Boom. Thank you, Jeff. Just use Jeff as a, as a sort of support fighter. Officer went by two, speed went by one, guts went by one, IQ went by one, two, five, and shield epsilon. Just level is now 26, offense, defense, and I keep forgetting to put shields up. I'm just so invested in attack that I just forget shields exist. Okay, shield. 24, protects everyone with a psychic shield. It blocks an enemy's psi attacks, and using a different shield will cancel these effects. Okay, psi attacks. Okay. Probably just does greater effects. Yeah, we haven't really been running into enemies that I don't think it would be real psi users. Okay, check. Coin of slumber. Okay, do we have anything we can get rid of? Okay, Paula. Help. Psy Caramel. Rust Promoter. Should have put that in. Check. Point of slumber. Let's check the let's check that. Help. Coin of slumber must be equipped as other. Increases your defense and luck. Okay, who needs defense and luck? Okay. Hmm. Status. Okay, let's equip. Other hard hat. Yeah, that I don't think we need to do that for Ness. Paula, red ribbon. Let's see how this goes. Okay. Defense would be increased by five, which we better than what we have. And as for Jeff, who was he at for others? Okay, here's what we'll do. We'll get rid of the home hats. And then we'll basically go with Paula. Give the coin over to Jeff. And Jeff, you can equip the coin. Okay, that is a big increase, and that will really help out. Run, Ness, run! Okay, another sanctuary location. Okay, in that case, statuses. Okay, Jeff, I mean, Ness can heal up. As for the others. Okay, Paula, I think she should be good. Yeah, and here's what I'll do. I'll basically create a restore point, and if things start to go wrong, 
I can basically then just, I can just go right back. You finally got here. This is the third your sanctuary location, but it's mine now. Take it from me if you dare. Okay, I'm gonna be cheap on this one. You know why? Because I'll just use Spy on the Trillionaire Sprout. See what it's weak to? Fire, okay. Load the restore points. Okay, let's do this. Ness. Bash it. Paul, okay, actually, no, no, no. Ness. We'll basically see if we can use a paralysis on it. Paula. We'll basically use a fire bet. We'll use a fire beta. Jeff, I think this is worth using your bottle rocket. One fifteen damage. One thirty seven. One six five. Ow. Did not work. Okay, screw it. We'll just attack with everything we've got. And Jeff, you can use another bottle rocket. Boom. And fire. Did not work. Okay, Paula. Let's use it. Let's see. Let's see if we can actually get. It. Let's see if we can do it properly. One seventeen. One forty six. Okay, did not work. Two hundred forty. Okay, trillionaires. Trillionaires. Sprout became tame. 11,000 experience! 31, offense by 2, speed by 1, guts by 1, vitality by 1, IQ by 1, luck went by 1, max HP by 9, PP went by 4, 2, 1, 2, 1, luck by 3, 2, 5, 2, 1, 1, 1, 2. Okay, once again, another disappointing level from Jeff. Just Jeff is just standing there, just oh, what's happening? Ness thought he heard his mother from far away. She said, Be a thoughtful, strong boy. Ness's soundstone recorded the melody of the Milky Well. Okay, with that done, let's move on. Okay, I don't think there's anything down there. Nope, nothing's down here. So, let's make our way back to Saturn Village. And then we'll, and hopefully we should be able to make our way through the tunnel that, through the other tunnel that's being blocked up and okay. Okay, Ness. Paula. Jeff, shoot it. Boom. And this should finish the job. Stop moving. Stop moving. Stop moving. Okay, yes, more level ups. Okay, Ness, Bash, Paula, Breeze, Jeff, Kill. Okay, it's not moving, or rather, it's funky. 
Okay, and Jeff is dangerous now. Jeff has a mushroom. Okay. PSI ass. We're gonna wanna get we're gonna wanna get out of here. And Jeff, uh, you can defend. Okay. Boom. 67. Okay, bash. Okay, and Jeff, we'll, we'll just try, we'll try. Okay, stop so moving, good. Let's get out of here. Okay, can we heal Jeff up? Okay, let's see, healing beta. Poisonings, nausea, feeling strange, and uncontrollable crying. Okay, if you're fortunate, we don't want to do this. Yes, just run from us. Just run. We want to get out of here. Just stay out of our way. Okay, apparently he wanted to make things hard. Okay. Boom. Okay. Ah, come on, stop trying to kill Ness! Jeff, what is wrong with you? Okay. We should be able to do it. Okay, thank you, Jeff. You actually avenged us. At least this is better than Ness killing himself with us with his baseball bat. That rain bob was too late. Okay, is this enough? No, it's not. Rain boob, let's do it. And tame. 829, let's see what we're, how we're doing in terms of experience. 6,000, okay. Yeah, we really can't do much there. But hey, we're, we're, I, we're looking pretty solid as far as levels go. Okay. Okay, let's see if the hot springs will heal up, will heal up at Jeff. Okay, nice, Jeff is healed. But yet, we are not healed as far as, as PP goes and HP goes. So let's go. Okay. Let's see if we can do some repairs at the end. Yeah, and then we'll head back to three and see what's up there. And then the next episode, we can make our way towards that desert we were told about. Okay. Talk. Slumber. Check. Okay, yes. 4,600. Okay. Yeah, let me just do some quick checks to see. Yeah, the jar of fly honey, I think we can get rid of. Okay, let's see if we can sell that jar of fly honey. I know that this is going to be a bit of a walk. But frankly, I just want to see if we can get rid of it. Because really, it's, I don't want that thing crowding up our inventory. Let's also see if we can get rid of anything, okay? Paula can hold on to that. Okay. Sun Guts Pill. Rust Promoter. I'm going to need to look into the broken air gun and the like and see if basically there's anything we can do with that. Because just broken pipe and the like, can we repair any of our stuff? Broken pipe. It looks like bu a busted water pipe. That Jesus just should be able to fix it sometime. Why can't you fix it now, Jeff? 
Okay. Status. Let me just make sure we're healed. Yep. Okay. Talk. So. Let's see if we can get rid of that jar of fly honey. We. I don't think we're going to be using this. Okay, so in that case, we're getting rid of it. Hooray! As for Jeff, can we get rid of stuff for him? Okay, I think we're good with Jeff. It's mainly getting rid of that, getting rid of that one thing. Okay, let's go and just move the HP sucker over to over here. Give to Jeff. Okay, we're gonna get rid of the we're gonna basically get rid of the protein drink and the jar of honey. And if we can Yeah, we'll also get rid of the sun guts pill. Just because I don't think we'll need there's gonna be really any time when we're gonna need to boost our guts up anytime soon. Okay. Doc. Escargo Express. Really? How do they find us? Do they track? Do they trace the signal? Does Tracy just have some super computer that she tracks our location? Did Tracy chip us while we were asleep one night? And this guy just came from the front. He gave me climb the mountain. This isn't even on any maps. How do they find us? Jar of honey. Okay, slime generator. No, I don't think we can really get rid of that. Okay. Protein drink. And also, we'll get rid of... We'll get rid of the Sun Guts pill. Okay, there we go. This guy just runs off into the ether. He just crashed the wall of the cave. Tracy just has this all, can put the can put the FBI to shame with her tracking capabilities. Tracy, just wherever you are, she'll find you and she'll destroy you. Okay, but anyways, let's get back to three and see if there's any if we can actually move forward in the world. Hopefully, the place is all good, considering that the zombies are gone. Okay, Paula will basically use a freeze. Jeff, you can shoot it. Okay, violent roach can't move. And Jeff makes himself useful. Hooray. Okay. Okay, we get these guys. I don't think we have to really worry about them. I'm not going to go out of my way to kill every enemy on the screen. Just because when it comes to this game, just it's not all that fruitful to just go out murdering enemies willy-nilly. Because you got to get to an inn or you have to use PSI healings or PSI life-ups and the like. Which can definitely put a drain on your resources. Okay, let's bash you. Just bash this frog's brains in. Okay, I think we're good. Boom. Boom. How much life does this thing have? Okay, Armor Frog became tame. 552 EXP. Okay, if only we knew about that butterfly. That, that could have made things a lot faster. Okay. Yeah, we're really like, Jeff is a genius! He can build anything! Also, Jeff doesn't build anything. Okay, I think that any enemies we come across here won't really be much of a threat. Considering all the stuff that we've been taking on, just Master Belch, that giant Clod. Okay, it seems like there's nothing here. Yeah, I think that by defeating Master Belch, we pretty much saved Threed. Yeah, this area is completely empty. It's like a ghost town here. 
A ghost town without ghosts. Okay. Okay, this place is a lot better now. It's actually daytime here. Thank you for bringing peace and happiness back to three. Thanks. Peace. Love. I won't forget you. Won't you come back to three sometime? Since the leader of the monsters is gone, the ghosts in the tunnel have disappeared. The buses can get through the tunnels now. I really didn't think those kids could have saved the town. Who would have ever imagined it? And now everyone's just hanging out in the vast graveyard in the Bailey area. Alrighty. What is this place? Like the Falkreath of, of, of Eagle Land? Where basically, where you come here just to die? You come here just for your body to be buried? Okay. Let's see. Anything else? I want to go through the desert into the big city. I want to see the city. I want to smell like the big city. I'm a real urban type of guy. Thank you. Sweet. Your heroes. That rocks. Okay, was there someone there? I am saying right now, so I can't play with you. Yeah, I really appreciate it. Looks like there are cars now on the streets, so that's good. Okay. I'm so glad you wiped up the at the zombies. Let me give you a kiss. Tee <laughs> I'm blushing. Visit three again. Finally, we can breathe. We can breathe deep the outside air. Now that the zombies are gone, ah, the outdoors is so refreshing. No problem here, except this withered tree that seems out of place. This bulletin board greets you this evening. All is well. Good night, Checkeroonie. I'm not sure who you are, but congratulations. Okay, anything else? Anything else in this area? Whoa, dude, like my old girlfriend from Tucson hunted me down, man. Oh, yeah, that girl that we talked to basically said that her boyfriend in th she wanted to see her boyfriend in Threed. I'm totally bummed because I have another girlfriend here in Threed. And now we get to see the uh, get to see the epic fight between the three of them, basically. Haha, <laughs> check him out. I think he's the bee's knees. Oops, I mean, way cool. He used to be in a band. Come on, let, let me out. After the buses started running again, I decided to come see my boyfriend. I really shouldn't have, though. Okay, anything else here? Okay, what you have to say? Burp. Oops, now I'll get Belch for a nickname. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, crud. Hey, we killed Belch. This place is actually pretty calming now that there are no zombies around. When the bus up at the hotel all the way to poor side is how much? Do you remember? Okay, can we actually use the bus to get going? Okay. Let's see. Bus stop at the hotel. Yeah, we'll head out, see if we can get to the bus stop. If not, we'll just end things off in front of the tunnel. And then Pooh just get hit with the bus. That's his legs have been broken. Danger! Do not sit in the street. Read the schedule from the sidewalk. Let's check the bus schedule. It looks like the next bus will come pretty soon. This bus goes to Foreside. I can't let you on if you don't pay the $6 of the fare. Yeah, we'll go. At least our bus fare is going. Has some good music included.
We can buy drugs! Man, it's bumper to bumper! My job is to drive, so I can't get off the bus. It's up to you to do... It's up to you if you want to get off the bus and walk around in the, in the desert. Hey, it's a free country. Okay, anyways. I don't know if, we're, if that's going to cause anything. I don't know if that's going to cause the, the heat stroke condition. But anyways, I think now would be a good time to end things off. Anyways, I really appreciate that you stuck around to watch this episode. You're a great viewer, and I hope you come back for the next one. If you like this video, like, subscribe, comment, share, do whatever you want. And without, I'll see you next time. Bye.